Michael, tell us a bit about yourself. Well, David, I've been a Korean fan all my days. I uh, started going to the matches. My father, Bertie, would have taken me when I was six, seven. Um, when he couldn't take me, I used to badger my sister, Gillian, to take me. Uh, so I've been following Korean for a lifetime. Um, followed him home and away. Been fortunate enough to that uh, used to work for the, the Chronicle, covered the, the football, reported on the matches. Uh, for a long time, nearly 20 years, worked for the Chronicle. Um, again, fortunate to, to follow Korean throughout Europe. And now I'm a postman, but back doing this as a, a, a hobby, a labour of love and enjoying it. Um, and tell us what you've been doing for the club since you've come back. Well, it's mainly been, I'm doing the match reports on a Saturday, doing a few interviews with players from previous down the years, uh, it's getting the fine balance between the younger fans who probably turn around and say with some of those videos, who is, as Marty Quinn himself said, who, who am I, who is Marty Quinn, um, and at the same time I've had a lot of good feedback from people who've really enjoyed hearing from the players, so hopefully a mix. And for you as a fan over the years, what has been your sort of uh, most enjoyable moment? Well, lost the Irish Cup wins. Uh, I've always said all day a happy man if and when get to see them win a league. Uh, and we've been close a couple of times, and that remains the ultimate, I think, for every Korean fan. I mean, only ever won the league once um, to see them do that. European matches, the European away trips, um, even on a personal level, you mean, you used to do the pre season training with various Korean teams, and you used to enjoy that, mingling with the players always helped with the job at the time because you built up friendships with the players and things. So there's been a lot of a lot of enjoyable and positive things. I say I'm doing the post there and a lot of Korean fans on my run uh, always stop you when they get the chance just to catch up with the news. Loving the live stream because it's given them the chance still to watch the games. Um, but you know, everyone is of the same opinion they just want to be able to, it's the social aspect, you know, the likes of myself, we, we have a car load, have been going to the away matches for years, they just want that back again, stop with a bite to eat, go to the match, meet up with your friends again, uh, and that seems to be the thing, everybody just wants a bit of normality and back into the games again. And, what is it, and for you finally, what does it mean to be a band sider? Well people laugh, you know, but it's... Uh, it does mean everything. Um, as I say, I've been following them since I was a, a youngster. I remember the night um, the wife and myself were here when we walked out of here after the Port Shore game when I looked as if it was the end. And uh, I mean, people, myself included, there, there were tears shed. Um, so you obviously want to see them do well, but as long as there's a, a team out there and a club they follow, we'll always be there. Thank you for all the work you've been doing for the club. Appreciate it, thank you.